Did you go out and ever trick or treat when you were younger? Yeah. I did. I did too. That's how I got this. Oh, magnificent build right here, trick or treat. Candy bars, right? Mm -hmm. yeah, I like candy bars. I know you don't. I you, love candy you, bars. You love candy bars? And what's the number one ingredient? Sugar. Sugar. Yeah, we got sugar. Sugar is the big mama in here. 250 calories. One calorie of heat energy will raise one cubic centimeter, about this big, of water, one degree. So if I had a, a square of water floating right here and I heated it up one degree, it would take one calorie. And it says 250 calories, but in food, that really means 250,000, it's 250 kilocalories, made with a capital C. Small C calorie means, you know, one gram. This candy bar will heat up 250,000, 250,000 calories. That's a lot of energy. I don't think you're going to heat one gram of water at 250,000 degrees. I might be able to hold on to it. It turn into steam and disappear before that happened. But there's an incredible amount of energy in there. Do you believe me? <laughs> There's a lot of energy right there in this candy bar. 250 kilocalories or 250,000 calories right there in this candy bar. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. That's all you got for me? Uh-huh. I'm not sure I believe you. Okay, then. You hear that little... Have you ever seen a calorie? No. Mm, would you like to see 250,000 calories? We're going to release that energy. Maybe not all of them, but we're going to try to release them all. Instead of using the candy bar, which I'd like to eat, since it's mostly sugar. 1.86 ounces. Yeah. So if we put like, say, an ounce and a half of sugar, I don't know. We'll just put some sugar, about this much sugar. So I've got some sugar. I'll pour it out. You tell me when you think we've got about that much sugar. And you think I've got about as much sugar as is in that. Yeah. Right about there? Yeah. Okay. Is that about, about right? Yeah. Close enough? Close enough. Be close enough, yeah. If we eat this, it goes into our, our stomachs, right? Yep. We digest it. In order to digest it, another chemical is required to give out all that energy. I'll give you a clue. Ready? What the clue is? It's... <sighs> oxygen? There you go, brother. You got. It came to him, didn't it? Oxygen. Yeah, we need... I want to add some oxygen to this. So I went over to the chemical cabinet and I found... Potassium chlorate. Potassium chlorate. Yeah. Have you heard of it before? No. It's a very common mixture. And if you look real close, there's the formula. Can you read it? KClO to the third. O to the third, yeah, O3. KClO3. So that first K is potassium. It's kalium was the Latin name for that. And there's some chlorine, Cl, all right? This has a lot of oxygen in it. We can do this one of two ways. We can put this sugar in your mouth and it will set on fire and you can blow on it. Okay. To release the heat. Or I can take some potassium chlorate, about the same amount, I've just got some here. And mix it together to get the oxygen mixed in with that sugar. Which would you prefer? The first. <coughs> he would prefer the first. But see, I'd do it too, but your mom's sitting right over there. She's sitting, oh, she's here. The second, no. the yeah, second. No, no, no burning sugar all. in his mouth. Ah, rats, they're just no fun, are they? So I'm gonna pour out the same potassium chlorate in there. And it could be a little bit more chlorate, it doesn't really matter. So I think I've got about the right amount of chlorate. I would have you do this. I should get, cause you know, if we're doing this right, the kids should be doing it, right? But if it blows up, a lot of paperwork, so. La -dee -da 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 -da. So I've got the fuel, which is the sugar. Yep. And there's a truckload of oxygen in there now. And I thought, you know, just for fun, I was gonna try to ignite it chemically, you know, cause this is science. Instead of using a match, I could initiate the reaction with a chemistry thing. Maybe make a magic wand. Cause you know, I like to mess with people's heads occasionally. So let's see, I'm gonna put it in this pan. In case uh, this backfires on us and everything, would you all say uh, uh, gu goodbye, Elliot? Goodbye, Elliot. Because you never know. And if it doesn't work, what will we do? Die. Well, there's that possibility, but um, can you think of any other thing besides dying? I'd prefer not to do that today. Uh, go to the hospital. Well, we go to the hospital. If it works too well, I made a little pyramid of sugar and potassium chlorate there. Now, I do have some acid that no, you can't play with. Concentrated sulfuric acid, it's very mean stuff. And I'm gonna to try to put one drop on there. And when I get ready to do it, I want you, to, we'll, just, we'll both get out of here. If you do catch on fire, please don't stain the carpet. There we go. Yeah, I did that without spilling a drop. So I'm gonna dip that in there, see if I can just pick up a drop. Can I pick up a drop? Is there a drop hanging on there? Yep. I think I could fool somebody to, hey, I have a magic wand here. I'm just gonna, all I have to do is just touch it to this. Just that little bit, I can smell the chlorine coming off. That's pretty cool. One drop. Yeah, it does smell like a pool. Yes.
Somebody go up and turn the upstairs, open the upstairs door, please, real quick, upstairs. Upstairs, please. Oh, it's still set up. How much does it cost to get some of that stuff? That was like a fountain. That was awesome. Yeah, where do I get some of that? I really, really, really want some potassium chlorate for my birthday. Please, mom, let me get some. That was 250,000 calories. That's a lot of energy. The idea of how much energy is in the food you eat, how much energy is in the candy you eat at uh, Halloween. Now imagine this, that's only uh, 250 calories, and they say you know a person should eat 15 or 2,000 calories a day, and that's just to keep your body warm and keep it going. Well, I hope you enjoyed that. Did you enjoy that? Yes. And you want some of this, right? I do, a uh, lot. Too bad, so sad. Get your degree in chemistry and I'll give you a whole jug. So that's a good way to celebrate uh, Halloween. Eat that candy sparingly, otherwise your body will store all that energy right here. You know, we haven't had a good fire like that in quite a while. Actually, I'll just say it in the camera. I do that, really, we do that to keep the fire department on their toes. Well, if people would want to see more of this kind of nonsense, where would they go? Uh, well, they could go to TikTok, Instagram, yeah. YouTube, yeah. Patreon, yeah. Facebook. Facebook. And you can see Midnight Science Club. Thank you so much for helping us celebrate Halloween.